Hey y'all, I'm Dustin, and I get to serve here at Relevant Church. We are currently in week one of our 21 days of prayer and fasting. And we're focused on a verse from 1 Corinthians chapter 2, verse 9. It says, But as it is written, what no eye has seen, nor ear heard, nor the heart of man imagined, what God has prepared for those who love him. And in this first week, we're also focusing on that there is more. And that takes me to Genesis and the story of Joseph. I'm going to pick this up in chapter 39. At this point, Joseph has been sold into slavery by his own brothers. So you think, wow, how could there be more? Well, there is. It says, Now Joseph had been brought down to Egypt, and Potiphar, an officer of Pharaoh, the captain of the guard, an Egyptian, had bought him from the Ishmaelites who had brought him down there. The Lord was with Joseph, and he became a successful man, and he was in the house of his Egyptian master. His master saw that the Lord was with him, and that the Lord caused all that he did to succeed in his hands. So Joseph found favor in his sight and attended him. And he made him overseer of his house and put him in charge of all that he had. From the time that he made him overseer in his house and over all that he had, the Lord blessed the Egyptian's house for Joseph's sake. The blessing of the Lord was on all that he had in house and field. So from slave to overseer of this man's entire property. But wait, there's more. We go over to chapter 41, where now we see Joseph find himself, he's in the service of the Pharaoh. So chapter 41, starting in verse 38. And Pharaoh said to his servants, Can we find a man like this, in whom is the Spirit of God? Then Pharaoh said to Joseph, Since God has shown you all this, there is none so discerning and wise as you are. You shall be over my house, and all my people shall order themselves as you command. Only as regards the throne will I be greater than you. And Pharaoh said to Joseph, See, I have set you over all the land of Egypt. Then Pharaoh took his signet ring from his hand and put it on Joseph's hand, and clothed him in garments of fine linen and put a gold chain about his neck. And he made him ride in his second chariot, and they called out before him, Bow the knee. Thus he set him over all the land of Egypt. So from slave to property manager to now overseer of the entire land of Egypt. And why? Because God was with Joseph and Joseph was faithful. And we remain faithful and put our trust in God in all things. God always provides more. So I just want to leave you with that. Be faithful, trust in God, and he will provide more. Be blessed.